Good morning YouTube. Thank you for tuning in to my channel. I really appreciate you tuning in and listening, watching, enjoying. It makes me happy. It makes me happy. You literally are my friends because here in Australia I have no friends. <laughs> I need a violin, don't I? Me, 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 me. What are you talking about, Joanne? Okay. So today, as you can guess by the title, I have a product to review. I'm so excited. I've been needing a... I'm so excited because I have been requiring, needing as it were, um, a tripod. I have a little tripod that my G7X is sitting on right now, um, but it only is about mm, this big. And I need one that goes from floor to about my height because sometimes you have to present to the camera um, standing up and with this I have to literally get a stool from the kitchen, set it down, put this on top, adjust it so that the height's right and all that. So I just thought what would be better than getting a tripod. So. We looked online, um, eBay, we saw quite a few on eBay and mm, the prices ranged really quite dramatically and there wasn't any decent ones that we saw that were like a decent price um, and I've seen a few on other websites and I just thought mm, BW had one, oh, and I looked on, in camera shops as well, and they had one in a camera shop for $70, and um, it didn't look that good quality, and then we went to um, the Big W, um, sorry, we went to Big W, and we saw one for $40, and thought, let's try it, because the height was pretty good. It actually um, goes slightly taller than me. I'm five foot. I think it goes slightly taller than me. We'll have a look at it anyway. Let's go and unbox that baby. So I've just stood my camera on top of a little stool so that you can see what's going on down here, which um, this is where we this comes in because this will make it a lot easier when I have to film product reviews or clothing hauls and things like that because I'll just have this ready, out ready. So I'll show you on the Big W website now um, where to find it, where it's located, um, so you can order one for yourself if you if you so wish. Um, okay, let's get into this bad boy. If I can do this with these crazy ass long nails, look at the state of them. I mean, I love them. Aesthetically, they're beautiful. But um, practically, who wears these every day and how? How do you do it? Anyway, back to the product. Let's get this open. Work with me nails, work with me. I'm just in casual wear today because I just want it to be comfortable. And you don't need a glam up for something like this, do you? So this is it, this is the, the front of it, uh, 62 inch photo slash video tripod, 62 inch extension, folds to 24 inches, and it's eight pounds. Get this out. Oh, okay, so it comes in with its own little baggie. And it has a strap. I guess for when you're on the move and you're taking it with you to film outside, I guess, or elsewhere, or whatever. <laughs> I'm not a professional product reviewer person, so just bear with me. Just, just go with it, just go with it. Okay, let's get this bad boy out. Ooh. There's his feet. his baggy there. Okay, take this off 
there's a little instruction manual there. This baggie there. Okie dokie. So I'm guessing if I wanted, pull their legs out like that and just push them down. I'm guessing you can tighten that so you can tighten it so it doesn't move. Awesome. It's got a hook on the bottom. I wonder what that's for. That might be for a mic or something. So if these are really out long, you can hang your mic there. Maybe, maybe, or I don't know. Maybe there's an accessory you can get for it. There's a handle here. I think that's quite groovy. So I suppose if you wanted to take it out and about when you're walking around, then you can hold the handle. It's quite comfortable. Ah, so I don't know if you can see that. There's a leveler. So I guess you know it's going to tell you if your camera's straight or not. That is awesome. Okay, so let's figure this out. So at the top there's the part that you screw your camera onto. So I'm guessing this needs to be adjusted so that it comes this way. Oops, you need to free it up, so press that to free it up, and then pull. Awesome. Use this handle, I guess. Okay, so I'm not going to screw my camera onto it because I'm obviously trying to film this and that would be awkward. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to move you back. Let's see how tall she goes. Right, let's get these legs out. So I'm guessing you have to flip these up, two little handles, and then you pull. Ooh, wow. So I could stop there if I wanted. I could stop anywhere, really. So you can actually have it any height below the 62 inches. So I'm gonna pull them right out and see how tall this baby goes. Okay. Sounds quite sturdy. Feels quite sturdy as well. It's not flimsy. Right, clip those and stand it up. Wow. That is almost at my height. So that is, this is how high it goes. So that, yeah, that's almost at my height. So that's at my shoulders and I'm five foot. That is excellent. Fantastic. And this is the little adjuster here so that you can tip this. Yep, so you can tip it up and move it whichever way you need. That is fantastic. And this bit here, I'm not sure what this does actually. We've got a little jobby there. I don't know if it's going to zoom. Focus in on that please. It's not going to zoom in is it? I mean it's not going to focus. That's because Krabby's there. <laughs> Let's just move you Krabby. It's probably focusing on the crab. Yeah, no, no. So the indicator on... Come on. There we go. On this leveler, see is that I haven't got it straight. So let's move it. Oops, now I'm the opposite way. <laughs> okay. So, you can move this, you can move that. What's this for? 
I wonder what this is for. I wonder what this handle is for. Oh, it goes even higher, look. It goes higher. What? What? Wow. Have you seen this? Okay, I'm guessing it goes higher than me. It goes way higher than me. So like I said, I'm five foot, so I'm gonna stand next to it to give you an idea of how high it is. It's about a foot higher than me, I'm guessing. That is awesome. That is awesome. So far so good, I think. So, obviously I haven't used it yet and I will be using it today. But, so far it looking pretty fantastic for $40. I don't think you can go wrong with this one. It's, it doesn't, I just, you can't, I don't think you can get cheaper than that from anywhere else. Uh, it's just, to me, for what I need it for, just for my YouTube, it's, it looks pretty perfect, to be honest. Actually very, very pleased with that. So I've just spent, spent the last 10 minutes a bit confused about this bit. There's a quick release plate that you attach your camera to that slots in to here. And you screw your camera on obviously that bit there. But this thing here keeps getting stuck on the camera when I try and screw it on. Like you screw the camera and then you're pushing this bit it's to me it's just a little strange so I've took it off in order to screw the camera on so I'll do that okay I'm such a doofus I've just figured it out the reason why this was getting caught underneath the camera when I was trying to screw the camera on is because you're supposed to screw it with this if you can see this thing here you've got to to put the camera on and then turn that rather than spinning the camera on top of this. Rookie mistake, clearly. So let's get that done. I managed. Yeah, I was being stupid. I was trying to screw the camera around onto it, but it clearly had a screw behind it that you had to turn whilst sitting the camera on it. So no wonder it didn't work properly. So I'm just gonna take it in front of the mirror there's not a lot of room in this area I'm afraid but this is it here and it's got a, ca a, a camera <laughs> I am such a rookie at this it's got a handle on the back that you just hold in order to pan to where you need to be is my dog hey buddy Oh, he's sleeping. Okay, so my battery is about to die, as you can see, or you might not be able to see that. So I'm going to wrap this up. But I am pretty impressed with this for $40. I think it is. A bloody bargain actually obviously I haven't used it much yet I've this is the first obviously I haven't used it much yet so watch this space but yeah I think it's for the money you really can't go wrong if you're wanting some sort of um, YouTube setup and you need a, a tripod I just think wow $40 
Big W. Mm -hmm. Impressed. I'm impressed. Okay, guys. So, if you enjoyed this product review, um, please give it a like and please subscribe to my channel. I do a lot more things. I do goofy stuff, I do makeup reviews, I do clothing hauls, lots of hauls because I'm a shop shopaholic. <laughs> Oops. Um, yeah, so I do lots of things on my channel, so I really, really love you to subscribe and click that notification bell so that you know when I upload next. I would really appreciate that. And I'm loving my new tripod. <laughs> Thank you for watching and tune in for the next one. Thank you. Bye.